Hello everyone. Today we're gonna to be riding the worst rides in Hollywood Studios. Hello guys and welcome back to our Casey Life. We are finally in Hollywood Studios and today we are riding the worst rides in Hollywood Studios. There's a lot of great rides here. There's a lot of thrilling rides. There's a lot of kid friendly rides, a lot of dark rides. But today we are looking at one of the worst rides. Yeah, we're gonna see if there's a reason why they're the worst rides. Are they actually that bad or are they just not as popular? Because here there's some heavy hitters. There's Rise Resistance, Slinky Dog, Tower Terror, Rock and Roller Coaster, it's down right now, but there's a lot of big ones. So unfortunately some of them have to be the least popular and we're gonna find out if there's a reason for that. Yeah. Okay guys, and let's see what the lowest wait times are today. These wait times that I'm looking at right now are usually the ones that are always yeah. low wait times. So let's see. So we got the Muppets. We're doing all attractions. Yeah. Muppets, Star, um, Tours. Star Tours, and Alien Swirling Saucers are yeah. the three lowest wait times yeah. that are usually always with low wait times. Pretty consistent. Um, but then it goes to... Millennium Falcon is a little bit low. Millennium Falcon is really low. And yeah. it's pretty usually really... Well, usually, yeah. I think. Toy Story Mania is pretty low today, too. 35 yeah. minutes. Yeah. So let's start off with the three lowest yeah. wait times and see if we can add a fourth or fifth one. There is a lot of foot traffic here today, even though the rides that we're going on are pretty low weights. So it just shows you that it's even low weights, even when there's not a lot, even when there's a lot of people here. So the first worst ride, or at least... Popular. popular ride is going to be star tours and i'm not going on it going solo guys i can't go on it i'll be sick for honestly the whole day and it's just not worth it i get really bad motion sickness yeah and i can't go on it so josh is going to go on it solo and i'm going to be waiting yeah, for it's him. not it's not a uh, roller coaster type ride it's not necessarily a dark ride it's one where you're going to be looking at a screen and it kind of moves your seats around and you feel like you're in it so Penelope doesn't do well with those, so I'm gonna no. be going solo. Yeah, sorry. It's only five minutes, guys, so Josh will be out in like five minutes. Yeah. Bye, Josh. See ya, good luck to ya. <laughs> it's such a cool, I feel like this ride will be so cool because I love Star Wars, but I just can't do it. I can't risk being sick all day, but this is so cool. I wonder what's going on with Josh in there. I wonder what he's doing. I wonder how long it's actually gonna take. Yes, I'm talking about the main line right now. Ooh, sure are out of bags today. We <laughs> so you know you have this rebel spy on board. I can see that from before. Okay. Don't underestimate my power. Yeah. Hey, Josh just got off the ride. How are you feeling? Uh, pretty good. Okay. Um, it's. Good. An excellent ride, actually. Yeah, tell um, us why you think people should go on this ride, even though it might be one of the least favorite rides. You should just go on just for the queue line because it's so themed. It's actually probably the best queue line here. Um, there's like C3PO, R2. Okay. Really cool queue line. The story of the ride is pretty sick. Like, you actually see Darth Vader. You're in a little fight with Ooh, Darth Vader. Oh, I love Darth Vader. Um, not too many spoilers, but it's pretty sick. Slightly interactive. Why do you think um, people might not like this ride? And why do you think it, it is one of the lowest rated rides? It might be just because it's not in Galaxy's Edge. So maybe people aren't looking for it. Okay, uh, that's it's a good a really, point. It's an older ride. So the screen could use like a little bit of an update to be a little more clear. Okay. That's probably the only two reasons and I And I guess because you will get motion sickness. That's yeah, also motion sickness is a big deal too. Yeah. Um, but otherwise, I mean, if you don't get motion sickness, you should be riding that ride. Oh, so, wow. Yeah. Okay, thanks for the info. And, and now we're about to go on our second ride of today. Okay. This is not really a ride. It's more of a show, kind of, but it's the Muppets. Yeah, we haven't done this one in a very long time. I've only done it one time. Yeah. So I'm actually excited to do it again. So let's go on let's it. Let's do it. The wait is 10 minutes. So this is the pre-show. It's basically waiting until the other show is done and then we'll go in. But Josh and I don't really watch the Muppets or anything like that. So this is probably why we don't really go on this one. New remote control banana green pie. Ah, ah. Hey, 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 come in. Watch this. Yeah, 
sugar. <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen, for the first musical portion of our demonstration, we have Miss Piggy in a wonderful 3D number. Doesn't it look beautiful? Yeah. Too bad they're gonna spoil it with a pig. <laughs> Just got off the Muppets, out of the Muppets. What did you think? Uh, it's cool. It's not the best 3D show here. I do like the Bugs Life a bit better. Yes, um, as, here as in Walt Disney World. Yeah, it was pretty good, um, but I get why it's not that popular. Yeah, so like why do we think that it's not as popular? Why do you think it's popular? I just don't think, especially the younger kids know anything about the Muppets. I mean, we don't really know anything about them. I think it was the generation before us really so i don't love like it's funny but like not funny enough for me to go watch yeah. it um I, that's why i don't like it i do think it's fun for kids like the best yeah. part for me would be like watching the kids like trying to grab yeah, things like grabbing i think the, the best thing over. about it is that it's 3d i think yeah. that's why kids like it but also like why do i think yeah and that's the only reason why people like it i think they go for their kids because yeah. it's 3d and then like the older generation just loving Muppets. yeah there's some people laughing at the characters but we don't really know the characters so we don't know what to expect yeah we didn't love it that much yeah. um it's just one of those things that we're not really going to do that much but let's go on to our third ride of today and i actually have never been on this ride and i'm kind of nervous because it also makes you dizzy here we go let's go On our way to our third ride, I had to, we had to get some water. And we got this, we've never gotten this before. So if you get a water at Galaxy's Edge, you get space water. But it's actually- Just space water, it's space Dasani. water. Dasani. No, it is not. It's just fancy Dasani. It's space water. No, no. Oh, right, here's some music. Alright y'all, we're about to go on the third ride, which is Alien Swirling Saunter. I have never been on this, and this is like the third lowest wave, but honestly it's a 35 minute wait, so that's yeah. pretty long. Yeah. Um, but it is like shorter than the other rides. Yeah, it's still the third shortest, and most of the time it's a little bit shorter than 35, so... I'm kind of nervous that I'm going to get sick, because this whips you. It's not too bad. It looks worse than it feels. Promise. Alright, well I guess we'll see. <laughs> On the ride guys um it only took like 10 minutes yeah, no. and it wasn't bad and let's see if we're gonna get dizzy showtime let's see why people don't really love this ride <laughs> pleasantly surprised at the ride. I told you, it, it's actually not too spinny. It just kind of more whips you and it's a lot of fun. Actually. It's really good. Yeah. Actually, like, so one reason I think people should go on that ride is because it's fun. Like, it's fun. Like, it, it whips you just enough and it doesn't make you as dizzy as that I feel like I thought it was going no, to. No, it's not like a teacups or anything like that. Why do you think people are not going on this ride? I think there's too many good rides here in Hollywood Studios. Yes. You have Slinky Dog right next to it. You have uh -huh. Galaxy's Edge right next to it. That's true. Tower Terror. I feel like it is tucked it. away. Like, I've never been on this ride and I've been here so many times. But it's actually fun. Plus, a lot of people probably think it's for kids, but you can have a lot of fun on it. We just had a lot of fun. Honestly, so. yes. Like, honestly. I recommend And it sure. I think most people think that you're going to get dizzy on it but you're not. I mean, at least I didn't. You get a yeah. little bit at first, but then it's fine, it goes away. But I really enjoyed that ride and it shouldn't be on the bottom three, I no. think. No. All right, y'all, and that concludes the worst rides in worst. Hollywood Studios. Yeah, worst. We actually had a fun time riding it, yeah. riding them all. Yeah. Uh, what was your least ride, favorite ride today? Unfortunately, it's gonna be the Muppets. My, uh, I'm with you on that it one. It just didn't hit the funny bone for me. It I'm wasn't, with you on that one. I just didn't love it. And what was your favorite? Favorite is Aliens from Saucers, just because it's Toy Story, Honestly, it's a little bit thrilling. Same. And we love Toy Story, yeah. so I think also that's why. Yeah. Theming goes to Star Tours though. That ride uh, is I didn't ride that. themed so good. I didn't ride that. So that one, if yes. you're a Star Wars fan, you have to ride. Yes. Um, if you're anybody at all in the parks, you should ride all three because they're I all think, yeah, good. I recommend you going on all like going on all three, but that's just our opinion. Yeah. Let us know if you guys agree with us. Yeah. Do you guys think 
these rides are the worst rides. I know it's low, the lowest weighted times here, but I just want to know your guys' yeah. opinion. Because they're pretty good. Yeah, pretty honestly. Good. But other than that, um, give us a thumbs up. Yeah. Give us a follow, a subscribe, mm -hmm. and we'll see you guys later. Peace.